This is 14 over 9. A very nice super up daughter. She's a March 21st of last year out of a rebel red daughter named Benchmark Rebel. We don't have a lot of these super up calves and we sold super up to Rio Rojo Longhorns in Louisiana. So this is kind of a one of a kind girl. 14 over 9. This is 18 over 9. Perfect score. An unbreakable daughter. Look at that body on her. She's out of a cow named Tilda's Edition on March 23rd of last year. We're hoping for black and white for sure out of this little pairing. 18 over 9. This is 7 over 8, Unbreakable Fire. She's a March 14th Unbreakable Daughter out of Rebel Fire, a cow you saw in Unbreakable's pasture. We're anxious to see what black and white will do with her. We'll next show you her calf. This is her solid black private edition son number 218, born 610. This little heifer, beautiful roan speckled and spotted, number 54, is a uh, roundup blue boy daughter, born April 26th, and we'll show you her mama next. She's back there by mama. This is Poker Night. Poker Night is number 67 over 8. She's a May 3rd of 08 Shockwave daughter. She's out of a cow named Cowgirl Night. It's a real blended package here with this beautiful little heifer calf that goes with it. Being bred back to King Rio, 67 over 8. This is 84 over 8, a bounce super. It belongs to Charles Castro. She's a June 11th heifer, sired by Superman, out of a cow named Out and About. We love the color on this heifer. Whether it come, whether the, her <clears throat> first calf comes out colored like King Rio or her, be fine either way. About Super number 84. This is Breaking Cowgirl, an April 15th of 07. She's sired by Cowboy Man out of a cow named Firebreaker. She may still have a super up calf this year. She had a late calf for her first year. So if she doesn't have a super up calf, she'll be in here and be being bred to King Rio. Breaking cowgirl. This is Cuz I'm Fancy and her uh, super up bull calf born for uh, yeah, April 19, calf number 167. Cuz I'm Fancy is an April of 99 cow sired by Cowboy Cause, who goes back to Cowboy Man, and a Senator Cow. She's out of a cow named Fawny's Fancy Face. She's got a lot of butler in her, and we're hoping she'll produce black and white with King Rio, because I'm fancy. You can see her long, tall body in perfect udder from there. We're going to go out of order here, because this pair is just standing here so pretty. This is unbelievable, owned by the Horkies. She's a February 21st unbreakable daughter out of Permanent Believer, one of the best producing cows on our place that you saw in Rebel Red's pasture. She has a fancy, fancy uh, steer calf on her by Fielder, born 318. If anybody wanted a trophy steer, this guy would be it. Unbelievable. And playing nose to nose with uh, the fielder calf is Red Delta Dawn's calf, by, also by Fielder, number 24, born April 5th. Uh, another long, tall, bodied heifer. We'll get her mama out of the bush so you can see Red Delta Dawn. She's a rebel red daughter out of a cow named Woodstone Delta Dawn. Uh, has a lot of total horn here, tip to tip. Plus, around the curve, a lot of total horn on this Rebel Red Daughter. Again, owned by Dean and Mary Horky. This is Cover Girl, 17 over 6. A cowboy man daughter, owned by Charles Castro, born February 28th of 06. She has beautiful dark cherry red color out of a, a cow named Rebel Cowgirl. We'll find her calf next. This little calf, number 78, 
is one of the prettiest super up calves we had born this year. She's uh, by super up out of a cow named Holy Cow. <clears throat> she was born April 26th. Now we'll show you her mama. Here's Holy Cow. <laughs> She's a cowboy man daughter out of a cow named Overtabulous. She was the last calf of Overtabulous, which is an um, embryo transfer donor by Overwhelmer. Holy Cow has brindling all over her body and is a great milker.